Hey everyone, this is a 12 by 16 canvas and today we're going to do six mini pours, ring pours on here and tilt it and see what we get. So I'm going to set that aside and bring my cups out. I am not going to spray these. Um, well, maybe I will. I didn't want to add any additional silicone, but I think I'll spray them and rub it in. So I haven't done a lot of ring pours. Um, I did one on a Monday Night Live. It was a couple weeks ago. But I love the way it dried, so I thought, well, I'll try a smaller version um, with more puddles of the ring pours. But if you don't know what a ring pour is, you're going to learn now. <laughs> They're fun to do. Um, it's almost impossible to not get cells, even if you don't use silicone. So I just go ahead and use silicone. Sometimes you can get some great effects having the silicone in there. Okay. So I think I'm going to start with black. And um, I'm going to keep them kind of close together. So I can just travel down the row. I don't have a lot of black tonight, so we will see what we get. Made it through. I mean, I have more black. I just have to put silicone in it. Okay. So I wanted to do um, something with purples. So we're going to go ahead and grab... Uh, let's do the Liquitex Prism Violet. It's a pretty color. And we want to almost fill these cups, so we have enough paint to cover that canvas, being a 12 by 16. Then between that, um, I'm going to go ahead and put some silver. And this is um, Soho Urban Artist Silver. I love this silver. It dries pretty. Okay. And then after that, we're going to do a darker purple. Uh, we'll do the Lucas Krill Permanent Violet. Go ahead and separate that with the silver as well, just a little bit. Okay, so now I want to try um, some Lucas Lavender. This is a little bit lighter. So we're keeping it on the purple side. And that's the end of that one. So now I want something darker. We'll do the Soho Dioxazine Violet, which is a little darker than this Lucas one. And then we're going to go ahead with the Craftsmart Purple Pearl. back with the black. And the Liquitex Prism Violet. Some silver. Lucas Permanent Violet. And we'll go back in with the Purple Pearl because I'm out of lavender. And 
then we'll go ahead and hit it with the Soho Dioxazine Violet. Soho paints are phenomenal. Pigment is so great in these paints. Okay. And you already know that because I've been preaching that since I started using them. Okay. Let me get you where I want you to be able to see well. I think I'll start right here. And I don't care if it goes over because we want to cover the whole canvas. And I didn't want any white in there. Kind of neat the way it's coming out. I do want them to touch, so that's not a problem there. Still going to have to tilt. There's a lot of paint on here. Okay. Let me just give you a little torch to get some bubbles going. But what I want to do is get these together here. And I won't have to um, tilt much off the corners. I just want to help it over. Come back to the middle. I'm going to come right over to this opposite side because it's such a big stretch for that ring. And we're just stretching them out. It's kind of cool. I can't wait to see what this looks like when the um, silver is dry. edge. I'm trying to keep all my paint in one spot. Okay. Just touch up my sides and then I'll be moving it around for some composition. Because we're not balanced. bubbles in there I gotta get rid of. I'm not looking for cells so those will develop on their own. I already have a patch here. So if you're new to the channel, go ahead and click subscribe. 
click on that bell and you'll be notified when I upload the next video. Click like and share, leave a comment, and join us on Facebook. Um, shop with us on Amazon and Etsy and Redbubble. Um, check out our uh, fan mail addresses below as well. And if you do resin coat your paintings, um, we do have the code for the Stone Coat Art Coat Resin. Uh, it's CWA at checkout. You'll get $30 off an $80 order. Uh, the guys are great. Their customer service is phenomenal, and the resin is so good. Um, I did a test with the Envirotex against that one, and the Envirotex yellowed so fast, and the Stone Coat did not even budge. So if you're looking for great resin, that's the one to use. But if you need to get in touch with me to ask more questions and just here in the comments, um, do that through Facebook or you can email me at christinawelchart at yahoo.com. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you all in the next one. Bye now.